Hey everyone, it's your boy Doc Williams and today we're going to be talking about how you can create your own software with a service business starting right now. Before we begin, make sure that you like and subscribe to this channel. If you're interested in how you can create your own online business quickly, this is the best place to go. Now, if you're new to this channel, hi, my name is Doc Williams and what I do is I teach entrepreneurs how to create businesses and rapidly validate their ideas quickly. I use no code tools, but mainly I'm trying to teach you how to make money quickly with the skills you already have. And that's what this video is about. It's talking about software with a service, SWAS. Now, if this is the first time you've ever heard SWAS, what exactly is it? Well, you might've heard of things like software as a service. Software as a service might look at uh, different platforms like ConvertKit, MailChimp, things like that, uh, Salesforce. Uh, you might also think about infrastructure as a service. You might know about uh, Amazon Web Servers or something like that, right? That's infrastructure as a service. So what exactly is SWAS? That's taking your skills and it's matching it up with software. What, what's an example of this? Well, you can look at, uh, say for instance, you're a really good copywriter. You write copy for different businesses, but also your clients use something like Drip or ConvertKit, and they don't know how to use that software. Well, that's where you can pair your skill with that software. You can say, I'm gonna write this email sequence, but I'm also going to build that email campaign in the software. You could also say, um, I'll write the copy, but I have a template that I'm gonna be doing. It's an automation sequence. I can plug and play it into your account. So they're gonna say yes, if they already like your writing style. So you're combining your skill and software, and now you can level up with whatever you're offering and charge even more. You're not just solving their writing problem, you're also solving their tech problem as well. Let's go with example two. Say for instance, you're a front-end developer, you're a web developer, you work with Elementor or, or Divi. You're really good at it. But what you keep seeing is your clients, perhaps they're cake makers. You have a bunch of cake makers and they're all dealing with the same problem. All of their websites are terrible. They need the three core pages, a, a home page, they need a contact page, and like a gallery page. If you're working in a very specific niche, you can build a template out of using Devi or Elementor, whatever you're familiar with, and you can pair your services and your web skills to offer them the template, but also install it for them or make changes for them. So you're double dipping, you're offering your services, but you're making it an easy ask. And it's gonna be easy for you because pick a platform that you really enjoy using and you know really well. That way it's easy for you to transition and offer a software with a service. Now, another way to look at this is, if you're saying, but Doc, I don't really, I don't know my skill yet. I, I don't know what I'm going to be doing. Well, look for what people need help with. For example, we talked about stream producers in one of our Build With Me episodes, so many people are doing virtual events. They're switching from live events to virtual events. And a lot of people, it's scary for them to throw a virtual event. They're not good with Zoom or how do they use webinar software, all of those things. Well, you can offer yourself as a stream producer, do all the back end stuff. Or on the flip side, you could also say, I'm a stream producer, I make sure I'm emceeing the whole day. So just like a wedding singer or emceeing the wedding, you're gonna be there, you're gonna make sure everything runs smoothly for your event. And then that's it, you're done, you're done. You can charge anywhere from 300 to $2,000 a day for these events. And how do we know? We've done it. We do this as one of our service offerings. So if you're interested in, in that, or you want to know how you can create your own streaming business, make sure that you go and fill out the form below because we're always either taking students and teaching you how to do it, or you can hire us and have us as a stream producer for one of your events. So again, this is really limitless you're taking your skill, what you're proficient in, and then you're taking a platform that you know really well or you're willing to learn and you're merging the two, creating a mega power 
and then you're going out and selling that as a service. So if you have questions, you're thinking about how you can get started and do this yourself, make sure that you uh, put the, all of those questions in the comments section below. Oh, one last thing, keep in mind, if you're saying, wait, you've done all these things, how do I know if it's gonna work? Go out and test it. Go out to people that need your help or ask if they need help, offer your service and put a price on it. They're gonna tell you yes or no. Change your offering, change the pricing based on what they're saying and go and start executing. Don't overthink this. Software with a service allows you to be agile with your business and move really fast, but you have to start, you have to start acting. Let me know what happens. Tell me all your success stories. Let me know your questions and I'll see you in the next video.